Hello there everyone and welcome to another episode in Surviving Mars over here. Now in the last episode we finally got access to the uh, Tribal Electric Scrubbing Research over here. Um, which we also queued up. It takes a uh, whopping 10,000 research points. So um, um, yeah, we're only uh, generating about 700 per soul. Um, we have did manage to research uh, one fourth of it. So we are at... 22% and uh, the goal for this episode is to get them researched which uh, I am in the process right now I'm uh, analyzing those anomalies over there and once we get those two done uh, we should be a lot closer and um, Anomaly analyzed. beautiful so we've got not a thousand five hundred that is amazing um, got one more uh, that gives us another thousand, at least that would be perfect. Our rocket is on our on its way as well to launch the satellite. Another three souls out, but that should give us some money, which we will then use to um, yeah bring some more resources here, because to to build those scrubbers we're gonna need some more electronics. Uh, it is five per scrubber, and. Yeah, and I'll probably bring some machine parts as well. Uh, let's see if the prices... Yeah, they've gone up by 10 million again. I think. Uh, because we are playing with the inflation. Which was a must to get the difficulty um, over 1000%. So yeah, prices are going up as we uh, progress in the... In the souls. Great um, dust storm approaching. Dust storm. That means no power from solar panels. Mm, vaporizers will stop working, but we have banked us 200, almost 200 water, and that should keep us going. Plus, on top of it, we already have banked like 230 fuel here. And that's massive. Uh, how many do you have? I've also... Well, at least asked them to spread the load a little bit onto the other platforms here. Which they are slowly starting to do, so that's good. Definitely do not want to keep um, all the eggs in the, in the same basket. Where are you going? You're going that way. Cool. Oh, there's more of you now. You're going that way as well. Thank you. Um, yeah. I'm still thinking this fuel is very... They're really close to each other. Now a meteor... Uh, might take Anomaly two. analyzed. 1,250. Perfect. I'll take it. Not the max that we could have had. Wait, there's so many resources here. 82.8. Why are you not? Uh, yeah. Come and pick up everything from there. Bring it home. Yeah, the reason we have so many resources here is... Um, I think it was in the last episode. Oh wow, even more. Is that we had a meteor storm right over here. And just look at all that. Uh, let's let's have a look again. So 45 to and all those polymers Sector as well. Scanned. Oh, it's not showing on the map because I haven't scanned it yet. All right. Okay. So after we have scan deep scanned these areas, let's do this as well. Another sector scanned. Ooh, that looks like a juicy one. Now we have. Deeper in metals over here, 1,600 and high. That is good. And loads of resources here too. And that is very nice. You know what? Um, fine, we'll leave it. We'll leave it be. <laughs> right, so research-wise... 
Okay, we're doing actually pretty good. We're already 63%. So that means... I think we'll be almost there. One soul, yeah. No. So that's another three souls, four, something like that. He's gonna be back in one or two souls. Oh no. What happened? Ugh. Let me guess, you drove straight through here. No. You were already collecting stuff, but they started pulling you. Okay. Well, we don't read the resources right now, so... Yeah, let's just wait for the um, rocket to get back. The storm will uh, get to us in 14 hours. We have stocked up on water in both tanks, so... That is okay. And... Don't really have any other anomalies we can scan, is it? No. Right, so all we gotta do right now is just wait a little bit longer. Um, you know what, since we're almost full... I mean, we've almost reached 30 on all of them. I think we're gonna increase on all the field depots. Let's make it 40. Oh wow, that is a lot of concrete here. And I think we're gonna have to build some more depots over here as well. Let's do that. Just so they have a bit of a buffer over there and 1300 left, okay. So that's good, 1500 in total. And not using any for any maintenance uh, just yet. Um, but we will use quite a bit once we once we get the domes up and up and running. And here's the storm. That means our moisture vaporator is there we go. I've turned off. So they're not useful. And the same goes for the solar panels. I wonder if it's possible to have like all the disasters in the game at the same time. I'm sure that there must be a way. I mean with meteors you can just do one of the planetary missions so that's easy but can the dust storms and cold waves happen at the same time? Sector scanned. Or can they not? Wait, uh, that was this one. Oh, wow. So two more water deposits, but they're both low. All three of them are low. Uh, that could potentially be a very nice little outpost. Maybe. Oh, yikes. Again, I swear to God, this is like... Is it the second or the third time where our rocket is up, coming back from the mission, and then a great dust storm comes in? I'm not really good with the timing of this, am I? At least there's no people on the rocket over here, because otherwise they would just... Yeah, die of starvation in the... Um, in the rocket there. So that's good. That means we got more money. How are we gonna use that money? Are we gonna use the supply pod? Um, don't know. But I think we will also like to start going down some of these. Um, well, this isn't gonna be useful because we don't have lakes. We can't build lakes, I mean. How should we go from here? Mm, very good question. 
you know what i think we're gonna try and complete these and then we'll reevaluate our our plan um i do want to start sector scanned thank you good lady um would like to start terraforming and since we have the ability to research the breakthrough, uh, breakthrough for lake vaporators meaning we don't need to use our own water supplies that would be great however we don't have access or we're not able to build lakes because it's somewhere somewhere here it could be even be the next one i think um so we'll have to go down this route i do wanna yeah i do wanna get this going as well start heating up the planet at the same time i also want to keep going down the physics um, because I do want to get the MGS. Decisions. So. Hmm. Starting with ter uh, terraforming. It will be beneficial to do it as soon as we are possible. And right now, with the supply of fuel... I think we're looking pretty healthy. It would be quite smart and having tribal electric scrubbers uh, means we can uh, minimize the um, maintenance requirements as well. Uh, it's good. Resources are low. However, MDS feels like more important so that the meteors don't completely break our little base that we have we can't even call it a base but also it, it's gonna help us with the resource management over here hmm okay we'll, we'll see how it goes another sector down right so we have a average uh, deep metal deposit over here So that's two of them done. Right, so we wanted to go here and come back here. Maybe go like somewhere here, I suppose. Let's do that. Well, I think um, I've just realized I thought I was smart about placing these down to protect ourselves from the dust devils. I think it's taking it still come in from here. good yeah seems I didn't think about that before no uh, right almost full again this is okay so that's good they're all sitting at 40 uh, which means we will raise it to 50 now anomaly found e, that is nice two of them no breakthrough but still good I hope at least one of them gives us um, uh, six new technologies not just the um, it's either it, it seems it's either it gives access to two technologies or or six don't really know how it works exactly but um, that seems to be my experience so far I haven't seen anything in between it's either two or six uh, right 85% on this uh, if we didn't have this dust storm we would have had this rocket down a long time ago like at least a soul or maybe even two I can't remember that means we could have sent it out sooner to speed up this research over here and we could have also Sector saved scanned. our anomaly found a breakthrough nice I'll take that five hours and then we can land, fix the rover. Anomaly analyzed. Good. Okay, come here. 
We'll queue this one and then come back. Resources are low. I know. Yeah. Machine parts. Just need this. Two more souls. There's more to the barren environs of the red planet than meets the eye. Right, so you see there's only two. And we got microgravity medicine, medical center over here, and what else did we get? Emergency training, yeah, it was this one here. Cool. Alright, finally we can land. Let's take... Let's, let's see if, hmm, most of you. We'll reassign you to the rocket. Sector scanned. Anomaly found. Ooh, nice. We are getting loads of anomalies Meteor now. Meteor shower incoming. Uh, before that happens, please come and repair. Where's the anomaly? Here, right on top of us. And that's new technologies. Uh, yeah. Almost there. Anomaly analyzed. Okay. There's more Let's to the see. barren environs of the red micro manufacturing electronics factory and Lowest the risk of colonists developing flaws after sanity breakdown. Okay. Let's get one more. Almost here. Okay. One more soul, two more souls until we get the meteor storm. Resources are low. I know. We're almost Sector there. Sector scanned. Anomaly found. Another one. New technologies. Oh wow, they are coming up like mushrooms after the rain. So that actually answers my uh, one of the previous questions I had in another episode. It seems that the deep scans do give you more anomalies. That is great. So that is repaired. Can you do one more run? Pick this all up, bring it home. Thank you. And you come back here. Cool. This is almost done here. And then we have one, two, more. Yeah, that was actually pretty good. We got two of those, um, the key ones over here. And then we got a breakthrough. And another two keys here, so that's a four keys in total. Discovered. Sustained workload, what is this? Um, doubles the performance bonus when colonists are working on a heavy workload. Uh, um, not the one I wanted. Uh, Alright, so we completed one of the goals, which is... Analyzed 30, 30 map anomalies. We got a new rocket. Okay, that's that's not bad at all. Um, let's take a look. Have the prices gone up? 140 now. Yes, they have. <clears throat> um, I do not need these. I can always just research them. Same, we have access to this one. Not yet. We have it. We well, we can research if we want. I think what will be um, much more valuable is to get those resources. Now, how many do we want? That I do not know. Maybe thirty. Polymers seem to come down with um, meteors as well. Where? Whereas machine parts don't. Same with electronics. Um, I 
would like to keep at least 200 in here. So maybe we do it this way. I'm just worried this is going to be one of the events that comes up and we have the option to um, negate the uh, negative effects using using money. Drones. We can take two. Yeah. Alright, let's do that. Thank you for this. All right, 97% done. Nothing in here. Oh, really? Oh, well. Let's do that one. There's nothing here before as well. So let's do it this way. Okay, so at least we've um, scanned this area already. And that means uh, we are not going to have any surprises. Any positive surprises. So this means we could technically start planning this out. I am hoping and fully expecting two breakthroughs still. I haven't really got the ones. I mean, this is amazing. That is amazing. That as well. This, I don't think this means it adds any extra water deposits. It's just reveals the ones that were already there so if i'm correct this is useless it's very it's really pointless to be honest if i'm mistaken then yes if if the, 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 those are extra resources then that's very handy heavy workload yeah useful but mm, it's kind of average to be honest i mean we're, i mean once we had the colonists and we're um Keeping it very small, just just a single dome at the beginning. Yeah, it's useful. Once you grow into bigger uh, sort of colony, that you know you you probably are not gonna keep them under heavy workload Research anyways. Complete. Yes. What's the next one? Can exploit deep water deposits? No, we want to MDS. Was MDS in physics? I think it was. Was it? Maybe I'm mistaken that it's in like robotics or engineering. I mean, it's not here. It's not in terraforming. It's not in biotech. It's not social. It's not a breakthrough. It has to be in one of those three. I hope it's in the physics. Anomaly so, analyzed. let's pause for a second. And here we go. 15 medals and 5. Um, where should we place that one? Is it gonna reach? I think fully expanded it was, what was it, like 8? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So it goes this far, which means it's halfway through. I really hope I'm not getting this wrong. And I don't want to put it on... Hmm. If I'm wrong, I could still place another one like somewhere here. Because this can scrub all the stuff we have here. Yeah. That's what I think at least. If I'm right, then I'd much prefer to put it somewhere here. There's more to the barren environs of the... Drone printing... And rover command. The RC commander starts with four additional and can command more. Nice. And printing, well, I would want this, but it needs people to operate it. And it's weird to say it, but people is not something Sector we want right scanned. now. Anomaly found. And a new one. Another key. Interesting. Can we have more breakthroughs, please? I mean, I appreciate. 
the ability to see them. Mm, but yeah. Drone Swarm. Why was this one? Alright. I think we'll just do some more meteors then. Or... Mm. What else can we do? Resources, I could probably... Mm, don't need it that desperately. Okay, we're just gonna hold on that one. Meter shower is starting very soon. Well, let's get this next. You almost done? Should we sign it up? Bring some more meters, which means more resources and more anomaly analyzed. Anomalies. There's mm. more to the barren environs of the red. Right, two more things that we don't really need. One is research amplification, uh, which will be useful if you had domes up and running. And the second one, where is it? Oh, it's this one, deep metal extraction. Okay, so both were in the physics. Now. I'm starting to think MDS is not here. Hmm. What should we do? Um, okay. Maybe we'll go for another break breakthrough then and get the fusion reactors then. Oh, that is six. And see, 15 polymers. Polymers is fine. Um, electronics, however, no, I think we are not going to spend any of those. We're going to need electronics for MDS. Yeah. Um, do we have to queue up anything else? Yeah, it's cheap. It's oh, wow. Cost reduction, 60%. Yeah, let's do that. It's It's a quick one. And after that, I think we are going to go over with machine parts. I think, yeah. Well, we can still research it. It's fine. It's fine. We don't have to build them straight away. Uh, wait, there is another rocket coming. Yeah. Or we can just land it over here. That is okay as well. How much more concrete over here? 1,200. Good. Where are you? I want you to come back. Let's see where they're gonna land. Over there. Okay, never mind. I take it back. You carry on. You're good. Bring it here. Uh, store space wise, we have plenty of space. Research complete. And nice. So now we can actually put down. Oh, wait. Yes, it does. Good. I need the atomic accumulator. It's next. And we're going to need more power. Where can we place them down? I think somewhere here and here. And let's see. So, to make this work, we're gonna have to place another one in the range of the first one. So, these two will now uh, scrub each other's backs. Yeah, and since it's out of the range, we should be, well, even if it wasn't inside the range, we should be able to uh, keep up with the 
dust accumulation. Uh, let's make this a top priority. And oh my god, we've been waiting for this for so long. It definitely feels, feels like a minor victory. Uh, this one's done. Uh, yeah, minor victory to get the scrubbers up and running. So that means we should be able to Sector keep all those things clean now. Anomaly found. More anomalies. Breakthrough. Where are you? Come over here. I want you to do the breakthrough first, then this one. And then try there, drive back. Nice full load, 30 medals, and there's still heaps over there. I think... I kind of do want to upgrade the uh, transporter now. But I, when I think about it, it's it's just another thing that I feel like I want it, but I don't need it. Yeah, so we're not going to do it. Managed to knock myself out of it. That's good. Alright, so this rocket is ready to go. You know what? I think we are... We're going to send him out for some more meteors. Let's do that. Why not? We have the fuel. The other one's almost back as well. We can send him on somewhere, somewhere else. Um, with the scrubbers up and running... Oof, power. Not enough. Um, this goes to the machine parts. Okay. Right. Um, since we are at the 30 mark, I think we're going to leave this problem um, to the next episode to solve, uh, solve it in, in that one there instead. We definitely have to figure out how we are going to be power positive. Um, so, so, yeah, thanks again for joining in on this one and uh, hope to see you again.